subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. PhantomJS is a headless web browser that can be controlled using JavaScript. It's often used for automated testing of web pages or taking screenshots. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to install PhantomJS with Python, along with code examples. Install Python. Ensure you have Python installed on your system. You can download it from python.org. Install pip. If you don't have pip, Python's package installer, installed, you can get it by following the instructions here. Install Selenium. Selenium is a powerful tool for controlling web browsers through programs and is often used for web testing. Install it using pip. Download PhantomJS. You can download PhantomJS from the official website, PhantomJS Downloads. Extract PhantomJS. After downloading, extract the PhantomJS archive to a directory of your choice. Add PhantomJS to System Path, optional. If you want to use PhantomJS globally without specifying its path every time, you can add it to your system's path. For example, on Linux, you can add the following line to your .bashrc or .zshrc file. Now that PhantomJS is installed, you can use it with Python and Selenium. Below is a simple example of taking a screenshot of a website using Python and PhantomJS. Replace slash path slash to slash PhantomJS slash executable with the actual path where you extracted PhantomJS. Save this script as, for example, screenshot underscore script dot py and run it using the command. This will open the specified website, take a screenshot, and save it as screenshot.png in the same directory as your script. That's it. You've successfully installed PhantomJS and used it with Python for web automation. Feel free to explore more features and functionalities provided by PhantomJS and Selenium for your specific use case. ChatGPT